Minneapolis Metro, three and a half to four and a half inches of snow is what the NWS thinks for you right now. A lot of the snow is going to be falling on Saturday, but it could fall through Saturday night as well, maybe into Sunday morning. It really depends how quickly this storm kind of tilts and moves off. You could have some lingering snow. Southern Minnesota, you could see a little bit more, six to nine inches. I was doing pretty good. Like I said, Sioux City, they have around eight inches right now. Waterloo up to 14, Mason City a foot, Iowa City 13 to 14 inches. That may be on the high end, but we'll see. Cedar Rapids, 14 inches. Davenport's looking pretty good. And then as we move out a little bit further here, Chicago, the NWS is thinking about nine inches. That's where I've been landing for quite a while now. I think it's unlikely you get a foot or more. Not impossible again, though. And I'll show you what the high end totals are from the NWS in a second. Milwaukee, maybe around 10 inches. Green Bay, we could be up there around seven. Eau Claire's getting a good amount, potentially five inches. And then you can see the UP of Michigan, somewhere between really four to nine inches up there. Not too bad. St. Louis, two and a half inches from the NWS. Again, Again, more snow than what the Europeans expected. Quincy, around five inches. Springfield, six inches. Champaign, Illinois, maybe around seven inches, according to the NWS. Some pretty good snow up here in northern Illinois. You can see somewhere between nine inches to a foot. We get towards Indiana, Indianapolis, potentially two to four inches of snow maybe in there. Northern Indiana, we're looking more like six to nine inches. Michigan looks really good, especially western Michigan. Detroit, could we see up to six inches? Possibly. I'm surprised by this. The National Weather Service gives Dayton, Ohio, and Columbus, Ohio the potential for one to two inches of snow. I thought they'd keep that snow a little bit farther to the north. So we'll see about that. Again, we could have some mixing issues. Cleveland looking pretty good around five inches and then up through inner New England. You guys are already getting some good lake effect snow, but this is potentially going to be more of a one to three inch blanket up and down inner New England here.